Hey there, so in this video, I'm going to quickly show you how you can change the interface on Binance. Now, this video was inspired by a friend who was having some trouble changing it up, and so I was helping him out with that, and he said, oh, you should make a video, and so that's why I'm making this video. So if you're on Binance's trading interface, it you might have a page that looks like this. Now, what happens is if you go over here to this settings section, you can change the theme, you can do dark or light, right example, so it's right now on light, and this is dark mode, uh, and then you can even change this up over here, which is with this, so you can change the colors from traditional to fresh, so on and so forth, right, and then this is the classic view, right, so this was kind of Binance's old sort of version, but if you go over here to pro, this is kind of their newer sort of interface, right? And so basically my friend was looking for this part over here with the markets, but you can change the pro settings as well. So you, example, if you don't want that, you can just take it off by clicking the mar market, or if you don't want the chart, you can take that off, order book, trades, open orders, so on and so forth. So pretty much this whole thing here is customizable, right? And if you go to full screen, it'll have pretty much everything except for the market. So uh, over here on Pro, you can have the option to have your market right over here. So example, if you wanna see, check out your favorites, some margin, coins, ETF, BNB, BTC, alts, fiat, and so on and so forth, right? So yeah, anyways, this is just a quick video on Binance's interface and how to kind of just change it up if you would like right and again there's a button here where you can go back to default layout if you don't like any of this you can just go click on here old website and if you like their old website instead just click on that and you're good to go but yeah anyways i hope you found this video informative or educational and if you did please give it a thumbs up if you think that there's someone who would get some value out of this please share with them or if you have any questions or comments, leave it down below because I do check them and I do respond. If you're interested in receiving notifications on my future videos, then hit that subscribe button. Other than that, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.